to overcome all the straight edge and the string method to check miss alignment in pulley at any equipment you can use laser alignment laser alignment mounts magnetically to the face of pulley and projects a laser fan line on two targets magnetically attached on the other pulley all you need to do is to ensure that the laser line lined up with the unit's target like this and after that you will find one of these case or combination you may find this laser line at receiver or at mirror if you find this case you have vertical misalignment angle and that means your pulley like that if you have your laser line on sender magnetic like this so you have horizontal angle misalignment and that means your pulley in this position lastly if you have laser line on receiver or on mirror magnetic like this so you mean that you have misalignment parallel or offset that mean your pulley position in this position before going to the solution of each case uh, that i said before you should to you should to know your 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 target your target to make your bullies aligned like this case or you you should to make laser line on receiver like this and on sender like this you can correct vertical angle by chiming the driver then if you have horizontal angularity in your bully you should to move the driver laterally by jack screw or if you have offset misalignment you should to moving the driver with axial jack screw or if you have any opportunity repositioning one of the bullies on its shaft you can do it very important note at a pulley alignment if you have a combination of three misalignment type vertical horizontal and offset you should to start with vertical angle fixing and horizontal angle and then going to fix offset misalignment the last step after bully have been aligned is to proper tensioning of the belt you have three methods to check the tension traditional one or with this device or by frequency incorrect tension will affect the life of the belt and the efficiency of the drive as a whole the final step is to run machine for about two hours to allow the pelts to stretch and seat themselves properly in grooves the pelt must be then be retentioned to recommended value and then you can start your equipment safely